Yeah, now we will solve this problem. This problem is velocity versus time graph. Okay, so this way is the velocity, this way is time. So first velocity is a uh, negative. Negative means like velocity is uh, decreasing. Uh, and then it's going up, velocity increased to positive direction and velocity remains constant. After that time, velocity uh, decreases to zero. That means when it came here, it actually, the car is stopped. So car is stopped. The question is asking, Calculate the acceleration at 15 seconds. So 15 seconds is where 10 here, 15 roughly at the middle. Now how to find acceleration from VT curve? If you can remember from the curve, uh, we learned that the slope of VT curve is the acceleration. We learned it. Okay, so if I open, oh, it is already here. I do not need to, uh, I will have deleted it. So slope of the VT curve is the acceleration. We learned it. Or we can write this way, delta V by delta T. Now at 15 second, where is 15 second? Is roughly at the middle here. How to find the slope? Delta V divided by delta T. So what is my delta V? My V went to, what is the time here? Uh, 10. So V went to 10 when time was 20. My B was how much here? Minus 20. Minus 20 when my time was 10. So if I take this, uh, oh, somebody may ask me, I need the velocity at 15th. Why I'm taking this point and this point? Because this line is a linear. It doesn't matter if you take a small portion here or a bigger triangle here or the entire triangle here. It is a constant velocity from 10 to 20. So if the question asks what is the acceleration at 12, 13, 18, 17, everything is same because it's same line. That is why I'm taking the extreme points. Okay, so if I do it, it becomes 30 and then divide by 10. So 3 meter per second. Is it meter? No, feet. Feet per second is square. So feet per second is square. So that is the acceleration at 15 seconds. Okay, then what is the next question? Hopefully understood. Mm. Simple thing I'm just solving is a concept. Okay, acceleration at 30th, travel distance is 60. Okay, acceleration as 30th. That means here. So acceleration at 30th. What is the acceleration as 30th? Oh, where I went, sorry. No, here I was supposed to open this one. So what is acceleration? Again, I'm writing the same thing, dV by dt or delta V by delta t. At 30th second, what is the acceleration? What is the slope of this curve at 30? You can see here it is a horizontal line. Horizontal line means no slope. That means my V is not changing. There is no change in velocity. Divided by time doesn't matter. So it is zero. So at 30 seconds, even just after 20 and just before 40, all way 25, 27, 31, 35, everywhere my acceleration is zero. Okay, then what is the, hopefully you understood. What is the next question? Oh, I, oh, next question is, what is the total distance travel up to 60 seconds? That was the next question. Distance travel in 60 seconds. So S, now what is S? How can I we find S from VT curve? If you can remember, area under VT curve is S. If you see that equation or from the curve, whatever I summarized area under VT curve is our S. Okay, find the area, entire area. So first is negative, zero to, uh, what is the value here? Okay, one, two, three, four, five. 
the, there's a fraction here. I don't know why they gave us a fraction. We, we cannot read. Uh, any shortcut? Mm, no, no shortcut. Let me see the question first. Is it actually the uh, distance? Yes, distance travel in 60 seconds. Again, distance, that means do not consider the sign. Okay, so, okay, let's start. I will assume this value 12, 14, 12, 14, 16, 16.17 yeah there is there will be some mistake if you is for like a graph reading mistake it, this mistake is okay this value is roughly 17 okay so what is the uh, area of this part area of this part half 17 second and this is 20 second 20 second that is the area of this triangle and this area their area is negative. What is the area of this triangle? Oh, now it is this 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 triangle, this small triangle. That is half um, three seconds, and then uh, oh, oh, where it it is not liking me. Okay, then twenty seconds. That is the area of this small triangle and it is a positive I don't know why I wrote negative positive next is this uh, rectangle here to there this rectangle is how much that rectangle again positive that is 10 oh I wrote here feet per second feet per second uh, go to chart area 20, 30, 40, so 20 second here. So 20 second here, my speed here is 10 feet per second. For the last part, this one, it is a uh, triangle of 40 to 60, that means 20 second, and my speed is 10 feet second okay now hopefully you understood what i did or what i will do if the question is distance travel in 60 second that means you will not consider this negative sign you will not consider this negative sign just you will add this value this value this value the, or you will add all if the question is distance if the question is displacement you will consider this negative sign and then whatever the sum up, that is the answer. So hopefully you understood. I am not. Okay, it's still them. So I am solving here. Uh, I have, oh, the reason I was not solving is that I have no space, but I can easily do this. So this portion is one seventy feet. This portion is. Uh, 10 30 feet this portion is uh, 10 10 thousand 2000 feet this portion is 20 10 to 100 feet is it 2 2000 let me see one more time 10 10 100 yes correct so if the question asks about displacement say displacement if the question is displacement, I will add this and I will consider this negative sign. That means 100, I am going down to up 2030 minus 170. So that will be 1960 feet. If the question asks distance, distance only, then I will not consider the negative sign. So then it will be 2300 feet. Because in this case, in this case, I am considering it a plus positive. And for this case, I am considering it a negative. 
so hopefully you understood uh, this problem <coughs> at the same time hopefully you understood the meaning of displacement and distance distance is a scalar displacement is a vector okay so what i did i solved this problem 